Hello, I'm Surya and I'm going to show you how to configure NetAnim with NS3. So uh, I'm assuming that you have already in installed NS3 and if you haven't, run the following commands. Once you're done with this, get back to this video. Okay, uh, once you have NS3 installed, go, in, go into the NS3 folder, uh, NS3 all-in-one and you can see a folder called NetAnim here. Go into NetAnim and then run these following commands make clean and then qmake netanim.pro and then make once you have this uh, have uh, having run these three commands your netanim is ready to use uh, and once uh, that is done you can uh, try to use netanim on one of the example programs uh, you'll have the example programs in inside ns3 dev and inside examples slash tutorials you'll have some examples here so uh, it's not a good practice to edit the examples directly so let's copy one of the examples into the scratch folder and then edit the examples there okay I'll be using tutorial.first.cc I'll be using this file I'll copy this to my scratch folder uh, .cc. okay so uh, I'll use my favorite text editor to open this up mm. okay now this is the example code this is the example code now uh, to add a, a net anim to this you have to do some you have to follow the following steps now first you need to include include this header file uh, at the top of your program okay Hash, yeah and then go to the bottom of your program and before simulation dot run you have to add this animation interface anim of animation dot xml this is the name with which uh, name with which your xml file will be generated which can be used by netanim to show the animation and once these both are done you can set position to each of your nodes in your program using this command so in my program I have uh, a node container called nodes so I'll be placing node number one node number one at one and node number two at node number one at one comma two and node number one at two comma three okay this looks fine now uh, save this file get back and how you run this is dot slash wav run and tut1 you don't write tut1.cc just tut1 and now it's building it yes it is done so you have no error here mm, hence uh, this code works now let us go to the netanim folder uh, cd space dot dot and then cd space netanim and run netanim so here you get your netanim uh, gui open animation dot xml and you can see i hope you can see this node 0 is sending some data to the server and then the server is acknowledging it so let me show this to you again uh, you have you can modify the speed of your program using fast to slow bar here and you can uh, look at the IP addresses of each of the devices here using IP and then you can use Mac to see the Mac addresses and you can go to stats so to see all the stats of every node you have in your program. That's it for now. Thanks.